Now that we've removed viruses and malware from your machine, there is a good chance that damage has been done as a result. Don't worry, it's pretty easy to repair the registry and other problems that may have been caused with a free piece of software known as Glary Utilities. It's another great utility I've used over the years, and we're going to be using it in the next couple of videos. Now to get Glary Utilities, you just need to go to pcmtechhelp.com forward slash downloads, or of course you can Google it if you'd like. But I do have tons of free downloads here that I've used over my years as an IT guy. And uh, if you scroll down to the section called System Tuning, you can find Glary Utilities sitting right there under the cleaning and tuning section of system tuning. Once you've downloaded it, we're going to go ahead and launch the installer. Now I actually am just going to double click on the GU setup file that you get from Glary Utilities and that will launch your installer. Of course, user account control asks you if you're sure. I'm going to select yes. And it says welcome to Glary Utilities Setup Wizard. Let's go ahead and click next. And of course, I have to tell you to agree to the licensing agreement. This is free for personal use. Go ahead and select next when you're ready and then select next for your location of your file to be installed. And then we'll go ahead and add a, the Glary Utilities folder to our startup menu. And I'll take a desktop icon, but I'm not big on quick launch. And um, I will go ahead and disable the desktop icon for Glary Soft giveaway. Now they do often a package in other things with these software because they're free and that's kind of another way they make money. But if you're careful with your installation, you don't have to worry about any kind of extra stuff being installed. Once it's complete, I'm just going to select Launch Glary Utilities and we're going to take a look at it real, real quick. Now as you can see, it's very straightforward how this works. It's got a nice little feature called the One Click Maintenance, which actually doubles as a, or what is it, octuples or... What's, I don't even know the one for five, but it does a lot. It does a re registry cleaning, fixes shortcuts, does a startup manager, so it checks for dangerous startup item entries. It does the temporary files cleaner, so it cleans up temporary files. Not quite as good as some software, but we're going to be talking about that a little later. And it does spyware removal as well. In the, for the most part, it probably won't need to do that for you in this particular video because we just ran an antivirus and anti-spyware on this Faster 8 series. All you have to do on this one is just click scan for issues. It's going to look over your registry for any inconsistencies, and there's a lot of inconsistencies on systems that have been running for quite some time, and we're going to run in and actually repair those. Glary Utility is kind of unique in the way that it does all this in a single click, and then after it's actually located them and repaired them, you are going to have to run this utility a few times to make sure that all the repairs are done. Some repairs cause other issues to come up and then you have to keep repairing it. Now before you click repair problems, we have 81 problems and we have 14.59 megabytes found. Thankfully we did back up our registry at the beginning of this video series so you don't have to really worry about creating any kind of a, a backup at this point because in the worst case scenario for a registry repair which rarely happens, very rarely happens, it can cause system instability. But uh, for the most part, they actually make sure that there's no uh, nothing that can actually occur as a result of that. I think maybe uh, one time I've heard of that actually happening in my situation. Now, once I've clicked Repair Items, I'm going to click Scan for Issues again. And it's going to run through my scan a second time. And it may or may not find additional items. If it finds additional items, then I'm going to run the repair again. And you just do this probably two or three times will be all you have to do. And it looks like it did not find any. Now the nice thing about Glary Utilities is it does have a module section that has a bunch of other utilities you can run as well. This video just covers the registry repair and the one-click maintenance, but we will be using a couple of these utilities in the future videos of this series. Thank you for stopping by. Don't forget to subscribe if you like this video. If you have any questions or concerns, make sure you swing by the free community at pcmtechhelp.com forward slash community. Also, make sure you stay for the next video. My name is Craig Chamberlain, and you're watching the PCM Tech Help Show.